Greetings from Lipitsk. So here doing some more work in our house and just had some coffee with my friends. Eh, my friend and his mom and his daughter. And so my wife went to go pay for some paint uh, and material. So I was just gonna hang out here and wait for her. So I'm walking around. And one of the many Sydney city centers that's the thing, they don't really have one city center here. If you say city center, people aren't gonna know where you're gonna go. So this is, I've been told, one of three city centers. But anyways, so I'm here. Um, I've been to that uh, karaoke club before, that was fun. So I'm just hanging out and enjoying the, in my opinion, one of the worst times to be in Russia. I call it the cleanup time, when all the snow is melting and it's just, dirt you see all the dirt that's been left underneath the snow in the spring so give it a couple more weeks and it'll be clean and they do a pretty good job of cleaning it up but it's also rush hour so she decided to walk instead of drive because we looked on the map and it's exactly 13 minutes by car and 13 minutes by feet by foot so she said you hang out in the park and I will go there and pay and come back so that's what we're doing i like this area it's really nice it's got a lot of remodeled and new buildings mixed in with some old ones you can see behind me over there starts the where it gets really old buildings and we looked at actually buying a building back there and remodeling it but it was too much it's 23 million rubles to buy it which isn't bad but it's a historical building so uh, uh we met the lady yesterday and she said it would be about 90 million rubles to do the remodel and we have to do it under the architectural uh designs of the city uh and anybody who does any kind of construction knows the the final price is always 30 percent more so that's 120 plus buying it for 23 so you're talking 140 to 150 million rubles and that's like 1.5 million us dollars yeah i'm not doing that in russia i'm not taking my money from the us and that much money and putting it in russia no but i am looking to do a business here but i'm talking about a business like for 10 to 20 million rubles that's something much much smaller a small cafe or something buy some real estate rent it out something like that something safe but that's that's a big project it would have been really cool but that's that's too much i have too much going on in america to risk it and do that so anyways i'm walking there's a really cool mural of a famous russian movie even a lot of americans know about i'll take you there now We're gonna cross the dirty street. Ooh, it's in the evening, so the sun's out. The sun's going down, I should say. And here's something interesting. Electrical car charging station. Which is even funnier in Russia since there's, there are some electrical cars. Not very many. But what's funny is there's nowhere to park there because everybody parks their regular cars there. But it's now almost six o'clock. So people have gone home. And there's a lot of businesses around here. But there's a charging station. Imagine that with a non electric car parking in it. how much it costs you have to go on your phone I'm not gonna mess with it mostly because I don't know how okay so some of you will see the mural before I get there
the Toretsky grocery store. Here we go. Not much to see down a little non-busy street, but ugly snow everywhere. There you go. <laughs> Big bro. Patron Sila Brat. Cool. Precross. Okay.